beginning, teacher Cat and teacher Jazz play a very important role in trying to help her like school. So teacher Cat will actually personally hand carry Tina every day for a month at least. She wasn't aware of any single English alphabet. She doesn't understand, she couldn't speak. But uh, after she came to this school, in months, maybe just around two to three months time, she could understand what was being asked and she could actually respond in simple English figures. And now, she sings very well in all the English nursery rhymes. They are able to speak new words and they will ask us the meaning or they will come and tell us today I learned this word and uh, they will tell us the meaning and uh, yeah, new songs and all these things. Sometimes she just come home with like very surprising ability to say certain things, to recognize certain things. She came back with like additional vocab in Chinese and English which uh, both of us place big emphasis on her linguistic uh, ability. So when she joins Little Greenhouse, what I see is she has expanded her circle. She become a very confident person. She expresses herself very well, and I think she's very dramatic nowadays. For parents, what we want is the care and the concern for the child. Because you're sending a little girl to school or little son to school, we want them to be taken care of when we are at work. My mom-in-law picks Tina up every day, so there's a bit of a communication or conversation with the teachers. A little bit of what's happened in the day, what's to come and what to look out for. So it's full channel of communication with the school. Even till now, uh, PG teachers and I still have that rapport. And uh, although Sophia has now graduated to N2, her N1 teachers, her PG teachers, when they see her, they always call her, always ask about her, which is something so warm inside, you know, that warm feeling.